LPBW Roloff family member called out for toxic behavior. Today, Matt Roloff road accident. And Tori Roloff updates Mansion amid chatter that she really is leaving little people, big world. But why? I will explain everything. Never miss this video. Before going to the main topic, I would like to say, like this video and please subscribe to the channel. When it comes to little people, big world, and the Roloff family, there is always a lot to dig into, including a lot of drama. Recently, viewers called out a family member for what they see as blatantly toxic behavior. So what happened with this recent situation? The Roloff family never fails to provide drama. Viewers most often make fun of Jeremy and Audrey Roloff. Due to their divisive beliefs and points of view, the husband and wife are easy pickings. Not very long ago, Jeremy Roloff received harsh criticism on the internet for using his small children as passenger on an ATV while on his property. It would not take much for a situation like this to turn catastrophic, as many astute fans noted. It should come as no surprise that people were concerned for the kids' safety. Isabel Roloff has been criticizing the other little people big world women in the family on social media in recent posts. The wife of Jacob Roloff, Isabel, has always been more plump and curvaceous. She has previously faced criticism for this from program viewers. In a recent social media update, Isabel Roloff mentioned that a fan had suggested that Jacob preferred curvaceous women. He likes them with meat, the commenter wrote. He definitely likes them beautiful because he picked the prettiest wife of the brothers, a commenter said in another post. Isabel publicly agreed with the remark that she was the most attractive of all the brothers' wives in response to a follower's comment. Fans of Little People Big World for a long time know that Audrey Roloff irritates people quite a bit. Tori Roloff has also followed suit especially after she and Zach left the TLC show to launch their own podcast. Therefore, despite the fact that there aren't any stand-up members of the Roloff family or their spouses, a lot of little people, big world fans continue to criticize Isabel Roloff for what they see to be her obviously harmful actions. One person said, this screams insecurities. She needs validation from strangers and throws her own family under, nah, that ain't right. A second person agreed, saying, this reeks of insecurities. A third person piled on, adding, imagine being 30 and behaving this way towards family members. Not about something important that caused conflict between them, but about who is the prettiest. It's giving seventh grade in the early 2000s. Tori Roloff updates Mansion amid chatter that she really is leaving little people, big world. But why? Zach and Tori Roloff are bothered with the same question. Does reality television have an end in sight? While fans contemplate and conjecture about this possibility, the well-known duo did make one thing very clear over the weekend. For a brief period, they had to bid farewell to almost everyone else on the planet. The little people, Big World actress gave her Instagram stories, fans a sneak peek of her family's travel to a distant location. As the image below shows, Tori shared a snapshot of herself with her spouse Zach and their three kids, Joja, one, Lila, three, and Jackson, six. In it, the two youngest siblings are seen lounging on a rocky beach with their grandfather, who is fishing nearby. Perfect evening for it, Tori captioned the photo. Roloff then added, without providing any extra context, the following about this relaxing trip. After such a frustrating day, I really needed this. Of course, this may be a reference to anything at all. Tori acknowledged that she isn't feeling well these days, so we hope she isn't bringing up her own health. Our surprise when we learned earlier this month that Tori and Zach would not be returning to little people, big world was not over. Connor Chandler, Karen Chandler's son, spoke with the son about his connection with his mother, who was engaged to Matt Roloff, his prospective stepfather, and the latter's son and daughter-in-law. According to Connor, Zach, and Tori, who relocated to Washington more than a year ago and are a little bit apart from Matt, are kind of doing their own thing on this website. 
I've heard through the grapevine that they supposedly don't want to return for a later season of the show. Whether there is a continuation or not, I do think Zatch and Tori won't be around for the upcoming season. If this revelation is true, it shouldn't come as a huge surprise to anyone who has been following the roll-offs. In May 2022, Zatch called his father a cunning coward when Matt listed a portion of his farm for sale, causing a major scandal. The irate father of three believed that Matt had not first given him a fair opportunity to purchase the land, and subsequently shared numerous false accounts regarding the course of events on social media. This message is wholly untrue and inaccurate. That same year, Zatch wrote on social media, saying, My dad is currently manipulating the narrative before the season is released. There was disagreement between Zach, Tori, Matt, and Karen on the most current season of the aforementioned reality show. In December, Tori expressed her dissatisfaction with her role on the show and questioned if it was still advantageous for her and her family. She lamented the misconceptions people held about her family at the time. Later, she said to her followers, we're trying to cherish it while it lasts, but I think our time is limited. For the record, neither Zach nor Tori have announced that they are quitting the program, but in March of this year, Tori shared on Instagram that she will be making big changes in her life. Zach, myself, and our family are in for many significant changes in the near future, she tweeted beside a photo. While bidding farewell to activities we've done for ages, I'm definitely looking forward to all the new things we get to do together. In a recent video, Tori Roloff acknowledged that she's exhausted and disclosed that she and her husband Zach are having marital issues. In a sneak peek for the upcoming episode of Little People, Big World, Tori revealed her secret. In the video, Tori and 32-year-old Zach Roloff are seen lounging on their patio and talking about their love. The reality TV personality giggles to his spouse. You don't yell that much, but... To which she snaps, I don't yell ever. Zatch answers in a semi-smug way, rocking back and forth in his chair. Oh, I wouldn't say ever. Tori becomes irate and says, You don't give me any credit for anything. The 32-year-old makes an effort to convince himself that he does acknowledge her as Tori maintains her position and says, You do not, though. The mother of three glances to the camera in disbelief as she confesses. This is an issue in our marriage currently, in a confessional. Tori goes on, I'm worn out. Everyone wants something from me, and I feel like I'm practically pouring out of an empty cup. The scene then returns to the backyard of the Roloffs, where Tori announces to her husband, you're sleeping upstairs tonight. In addition, Matt Roloff, 61, was seen reconnecting with his son Zach and his daughter-in-law Tori on Tuesday's episode of LPB Dolly. The patriarch had earlier put up a portion of the family farm for sale to outsiders, which had put the couple at odds with Zach had earlier said that he and his father would never be the same, but this week's edition of Little People showed Matt attempting to heal fences. He made his way to Washington, where Zach, Tori, and their three children currently reside. Matt went to visit Zach's newborn son, Joja, and to see how his farm was being worked. Asking Tori if he might hold his new grandson, he appeared happy to see him. The mother of three remarked, We just needed grandpa, we needed you to come over, as the little child grinned in Matt's arms. Zach, meanwhile, stood back and gave an uneasy smile. Zach was constructing a bridge on his property, and that seemed to be the cause of the father and son's bond. Zach revealed in a confessional, I know he's into bridges, and he's done a lot of bridge builds himself over the years, so I know he's interested in something like this. Matt was pleased that his son has been hard at work leaving his own farming legacy. He said, in this scenario, Zach is experiencing the satisfaction of being the owner of a project. I'm glad Zach is creating experiences of his own that bring back a lot of memories from his childhood. I believe he is playing them again, but Zach has no intention of taking charge of everything in Washington on his own. He previously attempted to negotiate with their father to buy a 16-acre portion of Roloff Farms, the family farm in Oregon where they grew up 
Together with his 32-year-old twin brother Jeremy, the sons and Matt were unable to come to an agreement. And Matt went on to list the plot for $4 million. Zatch and Tori first kept Matt's girlfriend, Karen Chandler, away from Joja during their argument. As Zatch accused his father of trying to make money off his own family, the two spouses appeared to be at a standstill. Karen finally met Joja during the National Meeting of Little People of America, though, when they eventually got together. Despite the huge family fallout, Matt was still unable to find a buyer for his $4 million listing. No more today. What are you thinking about this gossip today? Let us know in the comments and stay tuned by subscribing to our channel to get more updates like this.